Well, I slept good. Ready to kick ass today, but seven problems with my grandfather clock. Not dinging as it should. So I pulled it back out today to check out what I was, if I had something set wrong or did wrong, but I think I got it back to where it needs to go. I can get it when I manually move it, but when it just goes, so I'm going to wait until it hits this next hour in the next like seven minutes. See what it does. If not, I might just pull the whole mechanism out and take it to the guys at uh, Calhoun's and just have them clean it, clean the whole thing. Because it was pretty, kind of really dirty, like where you showed me to take a toothpick around the little, uh, little, uh, I guess you call them bushings, bearings, whatever you want to call them. All of those little ones. I mean, there's a pretty darn good amount of dirt. And even like kind of inside of it. Wouldn't be a bad deal to take them out and have them professionally clean it we'll see other things I got to get done I'm gonna get a, a couple of vlogs done real quick and just uploading while I uh, knock out some more research and prepping and planning for the for my business spend time in the office today be good because it's like 20 degrees and feels like 11 outside yeah okay well, I decided to take a break from the vlogs and everything else the screen is just hurt. I still have not messed with my clock yet. I've taken everything off yet. I'm going to retake all that back off and double check everything. So I went out and grabbed my little sockets and everything that I needed. I did that a little bit ago. Then I remembered I wanted to look at the sink in here. The sink in here would run like that. And then after, geez, like, oh, a couple... Oh, maybe 30 seconds. It would just doop, and it would go down to like a third of that, which was really strange, which I figured was probably need to pull off the bottom part with a strainer. So I pulled that off, and it was all kinds of like, uh, like a little bit of sand and like little just, just little bits of debris, the reason the screen is there. So it was like covering the whole screen. Came, tapped it, banged it out in the screen, and the... The thingamajig, the trash can, rinsed it all out. Good as new. So I went and did that to all three of the bathrooms. The only other one that had a little bit was my master bathroom. That was about it. The one in the mudroom didn't really have any. So that was good to do. Got that knocked out. Um, the dogs are actually outside. We went outside a little bit ago. That's why I grabbed all these tools. And now I'm going to take some trash, throw it out in the burn pile. I saw Callie the other day, and the next door neighbor's dog to the west. Saw Callie over in my yard again. She really, really tweaks me off. It's like, well, but it's kind of payback because uh, every now and then one of my bags that I have will come up missing, and I'll see a little bit scattered in my yard, but it'll all be right about halfway over to Dan's, uh, or not Dan, uh, Robin and Debbie's house. Yep, Callie must have done it again, because I had one bag out here, and it's not out here again. So we'll see it here. Who knows where it's at over in Robin's yard, probably, getting all torn apart. And I don't feel one bit of bad, because uh, I should not have to worry about... Look at you guys go. Come on. Hey, come on, this way. Come on. Go, go, go. <laughs> Okay, back to what I was saying. I should not feel, have to worry about what I put in my burn pile because I put nothing smelly out there. It's literally nothing. If your dog can't stay over here and if we need to have a talk about it, maybe we will. If, it's like, I like Callie. She's a good dog to play with and whatnot. But if she ends up uh, continually doing that and like stuff gets in my yard, well, then I'll just maybe get a BB gun and shoot her in the ass out right of my yard and tell Dan or uh, Robin him like it's not even the coyotes it's your dog so that's one thing that tweaks me off a little bit I think I'm gonna start with the razor and I'm gonna go uh, check the mail with the dogs let them run down and chase me real quick it's nice out ish the old Kansas thing to say not much wind so it makes it nice all right let's go do that real quick